No matter the size or location, all television studios are kind of the same. Knowing how your studio works will help you make the best use of it. A good studio needs to have hard level floors so cameras can travel freely and smoothly. Also, a good studio should have high ceilings. This makes it possible to accommodate tall scenery and hang lights. Small studios have 14 foot ceilings. Most professional studios have ceilings that are 30 or more feet above the floor. Our studio at Madison Media Institute has a hard wall psychorama. While some say it looks like a skateboard ramp, it's actually a convenient neutral background. The curves blend the floor and walls for a seamless, no horizon look. Most of the lights in the video production studio are suspended from a lighting grid. Hanging the lights keeps them out of the camera range and allows cameras and people to move around. Most studios have a lighting patch board and dimmer controls. Reliable intercom systems are important. Each member of the production crew wears a headset with a microphone for talkback. These headsets let the crew be in constant voice contact with one another. There's also a studio address system. This loudspeaker is sometimes called a god box and lets the director talk to the entire studio at once. A monitor is a video receiver that can get broadcast signals. A studio should have at least one large monitor that shows a line out picture to everyone on the floor. But looking at the line out picture, the crew can check their shots. News and weather cast use monitors to guide their positions and delivery. A studio control room is in the separate area of the studio. The people who normally work in the control room are the director, the producer, graphics operator, and audio engineer. Even a small control room like this one has a lot of monitors. They include preview monitor, line monitor, an air monitor, or program monitor, two camera monitors, a playback monitor for video roll-ins or bumpers, a teleprompter monitor. The monitors are stacked in front of the director and the technical director. Working in the studio is a fun, effective way to do the job. It gives the production crew a complete control. And no worries about the weather. This is Andrea reporting.